Welcome back to Helping Others, where Jacinia is interviewing Miss Miles. Hello, guys. I'm Jacinia, and I'm going to be your host for Helping Others. With I'm going to be interviewing Miss Miles. Hello, everyone. Thank you, Jacinia, for having me today. Super excited to be here, and I uh, also just want to thank you because I know this is new for you to yes. do this too. So I'm very proud of you for yes. stepping out of your comfort zone and trying something new. Uh, do you mind if I ask you some questions? You go right ahead. Okay, how long have you been at Lena Dunn? I've been at Lena Dunn, this will be my 17th year. 17th yes, year? Yes, this is the only school I've ever taught at. So my very first year I started at Lena Dunn and still here at Lena Dunn. Um, I'm very excited and happy for that opportunity. Um, I started off as a fifth grade teacher for a couple years mm -hmm. and then moved to fourth grade and then now currently in the data coach position at Lena Dunn. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> and what is your favorite part about being at Lena Dunn? Oh my, I don't think there's enough time to talk about that. <laughs> there's so many great things at Lena Dunn. I think my favorite is just how everyone here, the adults, um, the faculty, the staff, the students, are just one big family. You know, it doesn't matter what, what grade you're in or what class you're in, that everyone is always checking on each other and helping each other out. Thank you for sharing that. And as a child in elementary school, who was your ace? An ace is somebody who believes in you, and so who was your ace? My ace in elementary school were definitely my parents. Yes. Um, my parents always set the bar, high expectation level, um, always expected our best all the time, even if you know we tried and maybe it didn't work out very well, just to keep trying with it. Mm -hmm. um, but the, the, to be successful, my parents always had a huge part in that every day. Yeah. And what was your peak? A peak in a valley is something high is going to happen for the week and something a valley is low, something low. I think my peak always to start my day is when I have bus duty. So I get to see the kids straight off the bus uh, coming mm -hmm. in the buildings. So, and I know a lot of times we as teachers think we're setting the tone for the students every day, mm -hmm. but what they don't understand a lot too is they're setting the tone for me every day too. So I love to start my day uh, with seeing the students right in, coming in off the bus, right into the building before they start their day. Mm -hmm. And they also uh, make me excited to be here every day too. Okay. And uh, what is your valley for this Then week? the valley would be the flip side of that is then when the kids have to go home. Uh -huh. So, you know, you get to see the kids all day long and Again, that's the best part of our day as teachers and educators. And then sometimes the tough part is is when the kids have to leave the building to go home. Um, but you know that they'll be back here within the next 24 hours. <laughs> and what is your hobby or what do you like doing in your free time? Free time. I don't know if I would say I have much free time. I feel like there's 24 hours in a day and I try to use as many of those 24 hours as I can. Um, but I would say, you know, without with not being here at Lena Dunn and teaching, my next thing is basketball. I spend a lot of time with um, uh, players at all ages, um, from second grade all the way up to the high school level. I really enjoy doing that and just uh, working with students and working with players um, and also just being outside. Anytime I have a chance just to be outside, whether it's going for a walk um, or just reading a book outside or any, any type of uh, yard work outside, mm -hmm. I just enjoy being out there. And do you have anything else to share for everybody who's watching at Lena Dunn? Everyone is watching here at Lena Dunn. It's kind of pressure's on, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. But I think again, like Jacinia, I'm super proud of you. I think, you know, Thank again, you. This, this is hard to do. It's not easy to do what you're doing today and stepping out of your comfort zone for the first time. Um, that as nervous as you might be, I'm just as nervous. <laughs> and, and I think uh, being nervous is normal, especially if, if something is really, really important to you because you want to make sure that you do a good job of it. And I think Jacinia did a fabulous job today. Thank I'm proud you. of you. You're welcome. Bye, everybody. See you, everybody. Bye. Well, that was wonderful. Thank you so much for your time. And Jacinia, you did a wonderful job.